Hello, hello. Back in my happy place, my happy area, and today's visit. I'm visiting Spitalfields Market, a place actually I've been to several times before, but never actually captured it with the GoPro. So that is the plan. Uh, there's been a market on the particular site for hundreds and hundreds of years. It actually goes back to, I believe, um, just after the Great Fire of London. So, just walking around here, I'm actually going the wrong way. Um, yeah, Great Fire of London, Spitalfields Market. Um, it was certainly in the 20th century, it was a, a wholesale fruit and veg market. And was there until, I'm gonna say 1991. Uh, and then the entire operation moved out, moved to North East London, to Leighton, uh, which is up kind of by Hackney area, uh, by, by the Olympic Park actually. Uh, so if you're a trader and you're buying things wholesale in bulk, you go up to Leighton now to get your fruit and veg. Uh, the old Spitalfields Market, as it's now called, since the early 90s, uh, is now it's kind of a mixed use, like a lot of things are these days that are um, quite large former industrial buildings. Um, it's clothing, it's crafts, it's food. Uh, so we're going to go and have a little look around and see what we can see. And I'll be going the right way. And I'm in it mainly for the food. Back in the, the world of Jack the Ripper, really, I'm big up on Jack the Ripper. Sadly, most of the sites are no more. But uh, this is kind of what it was like back in the day. Avoid the um, new build at the end though, so no. Just, just these bits. We are here from the side. So this is the, uh, well, the, the buildings were built up, it's got 1885 there, so yeah, the end of the 19th century, they built a kind of, uh, is it called a quadrangle? It's essentially buildings around the market space, uh, of which now it's all retail units uh, on the outside of uh, the market. Plenty of people by the looks of it already in there and it's not yet midday. Uh, yeah, let's go and find some food. Just for a change. a lot of places like this which uh, they've got a hell of a lot of stuff happening in quite a uh, small spaces to eat early oh eat early
Okay, thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Jerk chicken. Oh yeah. Sorry. Oh, Alright, okay. Um can I get the mustard instead? Yeah. Oh. There you go. I went actually they didn't have jerk chicken so I've gone the uh, mutton instead. Uh, it was eleven quid. Two quid for the can of mango. Oh yeah. There you go, face of mutton. <laughs> focus on that. <laughs> Different use of a milk car there. Or milk float rather. Quite a lot of clothing, quite a lot of jewellery. I don't need clothing and I don't need jewellery. Um, a lot of the food is kind of around the edges. Getting busy, busy. You see, eat early. Eat early, he says. Okay, it's getting busier. Um, I still don't want dessert. Okay, what I'm going to do, given the fact that I can't eat anything more as yet, is I'm just going to go round the outer perimeter of Spitalfields Market, or old Spitalfields Market. So this is all the outskirts of the market building, so they've all got, I'd say quite high-end retailers that have jumped into these since the market moved uh, in the 90s. These are new, I've not seen these before. These are another installation. Yes, it's a goat. I think it's called I Goat, baby. I think it is. I don't think there's any significance to this actual area. Uh, it's just called Eye Goats, along with the elephants down there. Uh, this is a new area. We are at the back of Spillfields Market. Um, I think this is called. No, it's lost on me. Something Square. Bishop Square, is it? Hang on, I've got to check. Preparation, Gilbert. It is called Bishop Square. I wasn't doing completely bad. Um, I can just see the top of the shard there. It's not the shard, it's the gherkin. Get your vegetables right as well. Okay, this video is about Spitalfields Market, which is here. So let's go back in and uh, maybe get some dessert. Oh, I don't know, let's see. We come here too late, there's a queue. Elephant. I saw here there's an Amazon salon. Never seen one. I don't know how that works. It's actually Amazon. Amazon salon? Okay. Okay, 
even for the sake of content, um, I can't stop any more food, I'm afraid. Um, I can't do desserts. I'm trying to cut down on sugar as it is. This is the main entrance to the kind of market rectangle. Oh yeah, there's another uh, famous building in the Jack the Ripper uh, history. Ten bells. All very historic. I say that was the site of one of the murders. There's an old street there. That's now gone. Uh, but yeah, here we are at the, the proper, true entrance to Spillfields Market. And it's going to piss down with rain. Let's go over here. I've never been in the Ten Bells. Maybe it's time. Actually, I think everybody else is in it. Right, Brick Lane is up there. And it's street art, you see. Street art is calling me. So I think for now, I will sign off here. Um, great place to come, Spillfields Market or old Spitalfields Market now uh, but yeah, if you want some food, go in there ok, I'm just literally tagging this on to the end of the video because Spitalfields Market is literally just there anyway, Mr Sen's street artist yet another iteration of this wall yet another female he seems to paint this particular wall i'd say relatively uh, yeah relatively often down the years this is the latest one and for once there's no rubbish dumped there's no rubbish there no rubbish dumped in front of it got a clear view this time Thanks.